So some confusion and worry today on CNN when the monthly siren test started going off during the reporter's live shot. Uh, the anchor abruptly ended the shot, saying they wanted to make sure everyone was okay. Courtney Godfrey joins us live tonight with more on this local story. Courtney. Yeah, no sirens tonight, Randy. And if they were going off, we would be seeking shelter because uh, that would mean that something serious was actually happening. Now, these sirens go off once a month. It's a drill just to make sure everything is working. Minnesotans know that. But for all the international media that's in town for the George Floyd trial, that siren today was just a bit alarming. Just a routine weather test that happens every month. What was seen as a possible threat of imminent danger to at least one out-of-town journalist was just another first Wednesday of the month to the majority of Minnesotans. We need to make sure that people are, are understand the different warning tools available to them. And uh, one, of the, one of the bulwark warning tools is a siren. While gray skies and rainy weather hung over downtown Minneapolis this afternoon, the monthly test blared as planned at 1 p.m. sharp. Hennepin County saying they will postpone if there's a severe weather threat in the area or in unique situations like at the start of the pandemic last April when they canceled to avoid unnecessary panic. But they say they won't be canceling just to avoid confusion among all the recent out-of-town guests. Once you start breaking the rhythm of the first Wednesday of the month, uh, then it, it even generates more, uh, you know, kind of interest and uh, confusion. And more confusion isn't what we need. A practice makes perfect when we actually do need them. Now, next week is Severe Weather Awareness Week. Thursday is the statewide tornado drill, so you will be hearing those sirens twice next Thursday, once during the day, once in the evening. That's just so that people can figure out where they will go, how they will prepare once they're at work, and when they're at home. Reporting live in Minneapolis, Courtney Godfrey. I do Fox wish 9. there was.